I don't think there are enough words to explain or express uh, the appreciation I had for, for what he was to Channel 5. The countless lives saved, he knows that. I don't think he really grasped though how significant that is. Do you know how many lives you saved? Do you know how comfortable people are with you being on air, whether there's a tornado coming into town or if it's just a sunny day? And that trust he was able to build second to none, and I, I, I hope he understands that. Garrett, it's okay to do what's right for you, you know? We're all so grateful for what you've done for all of us. So many people in this building and outside this building lean on him and require and request so much of him, and he's so great about giving all the time, and I think maybe here for the first time in his life, He's really getting a chance to prioritize himself and, I, and his family and his needs, putting yourself first. That that's not being selfish, that that is finding out what's right for you. The culture of covering, to use the slogan, news where you live, it will stay the same no matter who my successor is because I think it is part of who we are. It's part of our DNA as this TV station. We're the station that covers the River Valley in Northwest Arkansas. We don't just focus on one or the other. Uh, we know our viewers. We know where they are. The next chief needs to know they're part of the community. This isn't just a job. This is part of the community. You're part of what makes our area a great place to live. Um, and you got to roll your sleeves up and try to make the community a better place. We want our community to be successful and we want, we live here. We're part of this community. Five News is going to continue to thrive. Garrett Lewis, Alma High School, class of 1999. This is my little sister Heather. She also works at Channel 5. She graduated from Alma High School as well. We're actually all on the same wall. I've had the opportunity to go other places. I figured I could go anywhere and do anything and do the weather anywhere, but would it really mean something if you went somewhere else and just did the same thing? Or it's just sunny all the time, you know, where you don't have to work. But even then I thought I'd probably be bored doing something like that. I just didn't really want to leave family and I didn't feel like it was right. Uh, and family is really important to me. And so this place is near and dear to me. I mean, I, I met my wife in Fort Smith. We got married in Fort Smith. I went to high school and graduated in Alma. So it's just somewhere that I've grown up. Um, my kids were born in Fort Smith. This whole area is just, uh, just means a lot to me. And the reason I stayed here had a lot to do with just uh, family and friends and growing up here and just being a part of the community. For me, I started where I wanted to end. Uh, most people start their TV career and their goals to get home, but I started at home. Other than the sleeves, people hate the cufflinks because the sleeves can't come up. <laughs> I hope my legacy that I leave behind is just that, I've, that we've made a difference for the greater good and that I've played a role in that and that our area is somehow a more genuine, more authentic, more heartfelt place to live.